As many of you may have read in the Fort Collins, Colorado newspaper, the Poudre R1 School District is implementing a one-year pilot program where students in grades K through 12 will be excused from school two hours early each day for the first two weeks of this school year. In this instance, that will be August 19th through the 29th. The reason for this pilot program is that the high summer heat can occur during the last two weeks of August, making things uncomfortable. While this writer understands that with climate changes occurring around the globe, it is possible that the last two weeks of August could present high temperatures, which would make most of the Poudre School District facilities very uncomfortable. I would also like to point out that it is possible that the weather during that time period could end up being rainy, cool, much like this past week. Meteorologists readily admit that while climate is predictable on a large scale, the weather forecast for any given locale cannot be accurately predicted with any degree of certainty more than a few days in advance. It has always been the opinion of this writer that it is unwise to base important decisions or assumptions about the weather. Coupled with this is the expectation put out by Pooter schools that a significant portion of the elementary aged school children who will be released from school early will be spending the extra time of their day at their local base camp. Now base camp is an excellent program which provides much needed before and after school care for children in our community. It's a program that this writer strongly recommends and respects. Interestingly enough, one of the biggest strengths of base camp is that they have 33 locations across the city located in Poudre R1 school facilities. Yes, those same schools which are going to release our children two hours early because the Poudre R1 school district board does not believe it is in the best interest of our children to stay in their school facility with such oppressive August heat. It is the opinion of this writer that more thought should be given to this pilot program before implementation. If most of our children are going to remain at their schools anyway, then surely having them stay with the rest of their class under the care and guidance of fully qualified teachers is preferable to having them massed together in the gymnasium and playground of the very same facility under the care of a few very caring professional babysitters. Of course, that is just my opinion.